everybody, it's Twiggy and I am coming to you in my usual filming spot, uh, aka my bathroom. Um, I have gotten a couple requests for an updated soap collection. Um, this, I will let you guys know, probably will be the last time I take them all down and do like an individual soap collection haul just because it honestly is a real pain in the ass to get all these soaps down because there are so many and they're up on the top of my bookshelf as if you watch my previous videos you have seen. Um, if you're new to my channel please subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified as soon as I upload a video and leave comments below. Um, so yeah, um, like I was saying this will probably be the last time I do like a full like takedown all my soaps and show everyone like an updated collection. I'll still do updated collections like for fall and winter. Um, which winter I really don't need any soaps. So I probably unless they come out with a good scent will not be buying any. Um, fall I know there's a bunch that I want to get. I just have to wait until I get some money so I can buy some um, soaps basically. Um, so without further ado and me rambling on some more, I kind of have it organized by season. It's a little screwy. I have winter first, then I have fall, then I have like summer and spring soaps. Um, and summer and spring soaps are in no particular order. They're just kind of organized and grouped by the amount of soaps I own. So without further ado, the first soap I have is Mint Blossom. I won't read you the scent notes on all these because if I do, we will be here until tomorrow morning. But this one is Glacier Mint, Fresh Eucalyptus, and Iced Lily. Uh, I think this is from like last year's camp collection or two years ago. Then I have my favorite soap in the whole wide world, which I have five, six, seven. I have seven of these, and I'm surprised I don't have more, uh, which is the Cinnamon Caramel Swirl Soap. Um, here's two, here's a third, and then here's the last four. I had, I think I had eight, but I ended up using one this winter. Um, so yeah. Then I have Mary Cookie, which I liked this year's packaging, or this past winter's packaging, a lot better. I have five of these. Um, here's four of them in like last year's packaging, which was like super cute with the Christmas lights. Then the year before's Christmas one is Mary Cookie in this form. And actually I want to take a look because I think they changed, no, they didn't change the formula. I just like this one better than this one, which is really weird because it's only different by a year. So then I have one of the marshmallow flurries not a huge fan of this one um i'm happy i just got one then i have five of the vanilla chai so i have a, like one in that style and then i have the four in the vanilla chai like this from last season um i really liked this scent. it's really good um, I like it better in the toasted vanilla chai in this form and like the soap form than I do like it in the candle because the candle seems really light. Then I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I only have eight. Yeah, I only have eight of these, which is, you know me, eight is not a normal, like, you know, a big number for me. So I got, here's four. And this scent is the Cranberry Peach, which they have a Cranberry Peach out, like Cranberry Peach Prosecco, um, which is just basically this in the summer scent. Um, but yeah, so I have another, here's another four. So that's my eight of those. I have to be careful because like one of my lids cracked. So like when I'm, I use one of the soaps up, I have to like switch the, the cap. Then I have four of, maybe more, nope, just four, Frosted Cranberry. I have two in this form. Then I have one in this form. 
Then I have it in this form. They're all the foaming hand soaps. It's just like different style bottles. Um, I have a winter candy apple because I wanted one for my collection. As you guys know, not a ginormous fan of winter candy apple, but I wanted the complete set. Then I have Spice Gingerbread Swirl. I actually turned all my body care in this spring SAS because I really was not a fan of Spice Gingerbread Swirl. So I was like, why am I going to keep it? Then I have Frosted Coconut Snowball. Um, I literally just got this for the whole collection because I'm not a big fan of coconut. Um, but it might be nice in like the guest bathroom. I have Vanilla Bean Noel and I have three of these, which I wish I would have got more of them, to be perfectly honest with you, because I really liked the scent last year. Um, it smelled really, really, really cookie. I know that's not a word, but it did smell really like massive amounts of cookies. Then I have one of the Candy Cane Bliss. Hope it comes back, because I really liked this one. This was definitely a keeper. I just didn't stock up on it. And by the time I tried, it was completely sold out of my store. So... That's why I say don't snooze and lose, because if you don't grab it when you see it, you may not be able to get it. I have a Twisted Peppermint, and then I have another Twisted Peppermint in this packaging. Okay. I'm getting out of breath. There's a lot of talking. Um, then I have two, new, two vanilla snowflakes. I have it one in this one, and I have one in this one. Um, I actually think I return the candle in vanilla snowflake if I'm remembering my right. I didn't like the smell. The soap's good. I mean it's just iced vanilla orchid kissed with snow coconut. Snowy coconut I should say. I didn't know coconut got snowy to be perfectly honest with you but oh that smells good. It's kind of like a beach but in winter. <laughs> Then I have one of the Peach Blanini in the Shimmer Luxe Hand Soap. Um, I really like the Shimmer Luxe. I know some people don't, um, but I don't mind it. Black Tie Night. I like it's a nice manly scent. Um, yeah, it just smells really manly. Smells like a nice man's cologne. Then I have Rose Water and Ivy. I really like this soap. Um, I might put it in my bathroom like around New Year's. I have Champagne Toast, which I really love this one. I actually have Champagne Toast in the New York style too. Oh God, I love that soap. It smells so good. You could eat a soap or like they could turn this into like edible stuff. I would totally eat this. Like not like champagne like edible, but like just to eat. It's and then I have con cocktails and confetti. I got that one. Then I have fresh sparkling snow. I just have one. And that is icy and melon, holiday pear, and falling snow. And I just have one. I don't have a ton of that one. Um, then I have three of the cherry chill. Um, I think I had more, but I might have used one up or gave it as a gift this winter um, because. Sometimes, not gonna lie, I go shopping for people's gifts at my house because, yes, I am a hoarder of Bath and Body Works, and I will admit it, I have spruce Bath and Body Works because you need, like, one good pine tree scent, and honestly, if I remember right, this really does smell like a spruce tree. Yeah, it smells like a spruce tree. Um, so I really like that one. It, it literally smells like a pine tree, which is kind of cool. Then I have two winter citrus wreaths. I like this because it's like citrusy, but then it also has like a pine tree note. It's balsam wreath, fresh citrus, and forest breeze. It literally smells amazing. Love it. Um, then I have two of the caramel pumpkin squirrel, which is the exact same thing as the um, caramel cinnamon squirrel. They just like took the pumpkin off of it, um, which is luscious caramel, brown sugar, and creamy vanilla. So really there's no pumpkin in it. They just say pumpkin. Um, so talk about false advertisement. Mm -hmm. Then I have two marshmallow pumpkin lattes. Uh, used to have the body care in this, got rid of it because funny story is 
It reminds me, it has like that musk, and that musk smells like Catholic churches do around like the holidays when they have incense burning. So I'm not a big fan of it. Um, I don't want to smell like church. Uh, this is creamy pumpkin, toasted marshmallow, and warm praline. If they bring like a soap out that's just praline, oh my god, I'm going to get like 20. Because <laughs> I love that scent. Then I have two toasted s'mores for fall. I have two of the apple, afternoon apple picking from last season. I like last season's packaging, to be perfectly honest with you. This season's is okay, but it's kind of like, meh. Um, I have Santa Suds, Naughty, Have You Been Naughty or Nice, um, which is, I don't know. It says, oh, what fun. So my guess is that's what the scent is um, because they don't have any scent notes. So it's a mystery scent. If anyone knows actually like what the scent notes to the soap is, um, let me know because I don't know. Then I have fresh balsam, which is just um, evergreen, cedarwood, and eucalyptus. Yeah, fresh balsam's okay. It doesn't really smell like a pine tree. Um, I might put this in my kitchen because it honestly smells more um, fresh and citrusy than it does pine tree. -y. Then I have sun-kissed citrus, which is like two winters ago, which is sugary winter lemon glisten in the snowfall. Um, I think I got this one for like my kitchen in the winter time because I'm getting kind of tired of just using kitchen lemon. Then I have one frozen lake. I used to have three. I gave some away. Um, well, actually somebody bought them off of me because I was selling some of my bath and body works. So I could shop SAS um, because I had so much. I didn't mind getting rid of some of it. I have iced white pomegranate, which I have yet to smell because it's still wrapped up in its packaging. I have one winter because honestly I used to love the smell oh god I used to love like I mean hoard anything in the sense of winter but I have um kind of gotten over that smell to be perfectly honest with you because it's really strong oh I just popped my hip don't mind me um then I have we're gonna do some spring I have some more fall mixed in here too I have white peach Chardonnay. I think it's like from two years ago, three years ago. I have um, magnolias and mimosas. I love the packaging. It's super cute. It smells literally pink. Could have a smell. It smells like pink. Um, then I have sweet pea foam, which I like this one. I it reminds me a lot of my mom because she loved this scent. Um, so that's and honestly like. It reminds me of high school because that body care is like what my mom always used to buy me. Then I have warm sugar vanilla, or yeah, warm vanilla sugar, I should say. Um, I love that scent. It it reminds me of my grandpa, so it just has good memories behind it. Then I have a flannel. Don't mind my phone. Then I have a pumpkin apple. I gotta just check this real quick. Oh, I'll check it. I'll listen to it in a minute. I got a voice message. Sorry. Then I have citrus and sandalwood, another one that's nice for the kitchen. Trying to like organize all this so when I put it back on my shelves and it'll just go back. I have pumpkin cupcake, sweet cinnamon pumpkin that I've been trying to use up. Um, not a huge fan of it. Will not be repurchasing that soap. I have red apples and spice, which honestly to me smells kind of um, like a warm apple pie. Um, I know it was like, somebody said it's like bourbon cinnamon apple like repackaged, but which it is, it's juicy apple cinnamon and bourbon, but it honestly smells like an apple pie to me, which I really love. Um, then I have one coconut pumpkin latte because you guys know how much I so not enjoy coconut uh, which surprisingly in some body care I do like coconut now I'm, I've gotten better then I have woodland berries 
which sounds really funny to me. I don't know why. It's fresh thyme, crisp woods, and blackberries, which I think is really good. Then I have two crisp morning airs, which are right here. I'm trying to like load all this stuff up. Okay, so that's literally all the fall soaps. Now it's like summer and spring soaps. I have a Plumeria Sunrise, which honestly I thought I returned this to the store, so I'm kind of shocked I still have it. It doesn't smell too bad. I, I think I can handle one thing of Plumeria. Um, it usually gives me a really bad headache, so that's why I don't usually get it. To be perfectly honest with you, I don't know why I bought it in the first place. Then I have a Sparkling Citrus Grove, um, good for the kitchen. Then I have a clementine and chamomile. A lot of these came in like sets um, and that's why I have them. It's lemon and cucumber. Sounds like an interesting combo. I can't remember if I love the scent or if it's not. Yeah. It's not a bad scent. It's good for a kitchen. I mean, my kitchen stuff, I literally just wash my hands and go. It's more than like cute for the bathroom or something. Then I have sweet berries and blooms. I have sandalwood and citrus. Oh god, I'm getting old. Then I have um, Japanese cherry blossom. I have, oops, I have stuff falling over. Go figure. Um, I have three of mango mai tai in three different packaging. I think it's one from the two years ago, one from three years ago. Don't quote me. They might be two from last year and one from this year. Um, but yeah, I got some more of those. I have peach bonini. I have one of my favorite scents in the whole wild world, black cherry merlot. Love it in the soap, hate it in the body care. I don't know why. Um, I just do. So that's the three of those. Because I'm dropping stuff. Oh, I can get closer to you guys now. Um, let's see. I have two Georgia peaches. Yeah, I do. I have one way more bark less orange vanilla swirl. It smells like a orange dreamsicle. My least favorite body care slash any form care um, is, or any form, is watermelon lemonade. I absolutely hate the scent. I don't know why, but I just don't like it. Um, I think I would like it more if the watermelon was like that fake artificial watermelon that's like smells like Jolly Ranchers. To me, that doesn't smell like that. It makes me nauseous. I don't like it, so I'm trying to use that up eventually. Um, I have Tahiti. Island Margarita, which I love that scent. It smells yummy. It's just fresh. Then I have just the lab tested blended number four, which is rose. And it literally smells just like a rose. And then I have Wildberry Garden. I love this one. It smells amazing. I actually want to check something because I think Blackberry Garden is the same as No, oh, it's different. It sounded similar though. Wildberry Garden again. So then I have I actually have two of these. One is in my bath and now I'm using uh, the coconut eucalyptus. I really like this one. I wish I would have got more. Um, I have one of those in brand new, and then I have one that I'm almost done with. Then I have beautiful blue skies, which is cute packaging. Then I have two, oh, I can just go closer, Georgia Peaches. I have, oops, stuff keeps falling down. Be, posi be Positive, which is strawberry lemon, which I really like that scent. And I like, I have cats, so the bottle is really cute too. Um, then I have turquoise waters. I have crisp apple. I have sleep, which is black chamomile and bergamot, which I really like. 
Then I have Aromatherapy, um, I think this was like the Love Line Rose and Vanilla. Then I have a Almond Blossom, Blackberries and Basil, Heirloom Apple, Rose and Ivy, Rose Water and Ivy. I know they're coming out with Body Care and honestly, if it smells as good as the soap, I might get it because it actually smells really good and I forgot how good it smells. Um, then I have Sunset Citrus. I have three of these, which are the Nectarine and Sun Tea. I did not realize I had three. I, for some reason, thought I only had two, but I found a third sitting on my shelf. Um, I have one of the Kiwi Passion Fruit. In my empties, I did use one of these up. I don't know if I already filmed that empties, but if I didn't, it is in that empties for um, this month. Then I have Strawberry Vanilla Sugar, which is there's two of these. Okay, I can get closer to you guys. I have four. Yes, I said four as I break more stuff of the Cactus Blossom. I love this scent. Um, I actually like the body care. I know a lot of people hate the Cactus Blossom and body care. Um, so I'm guessing it's probably never coming back, but I really love it. It smells really good to me. Um, I have, I'll wait on that because I have a bunch of those. I have three of the cinnamon sugared donuts. I have one of the marshmallow lavender, lavender marshmallow. I wish I would have got more of this one, which because it smells really good, which is the key lime biscotti. And I'm not about to order it off of Amazon or eBay because it's like $20 per soap. I think that's outrageous. I have four of these. I have two more in my um, other bathroom. One is actually being used. The other one is in like the storage cupboard. Um, I got them because... I wanted a more masculine scent in that bathroom than a girly, like, foo-foo scent. Because I don't mind my bathroom being girly. So, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight of the Boardwalk Vanilla Cone. Let's grab four of them. Here's four. That's what they look like. They all, they're kind of all different. I have like one in this style. I have like four in this style. I have four in this style, which is, oops, as I drop it, this one. So yeah, I have a lot of those. And I have yet to use one this season. But I like it. It's a really good scent. I just have so much soaps that it's hard for me to pick one to use. Then I have fresh lemonade, which is good for the kitchen. Then I have raspberry sorbet. I wish I'd known this smelled so good. I would have stocked up on it when I was in stores. Um, that was like from last year, like last spring. Then I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I have six of these. One's being used on my bathroom counter right now. Um, which is the Blackberry and Garden, Blackberry Garden, um, which is pomegranate, blackberry leaves, and chilled cranberries. It smells super good. I really like it. Um, yeah, so that's what the packaging looks like. Then I have, well, we'll wait on that one. We'll have four, two, one, two, three, four. I have seven of these. I thought I had eight, but apparently I don't. Um, here's four of them, which is the New York um, Champagne Toast. And here's the other three. Oh. And then last but not least, my all-time favorite soap right now. And I love it. I'm going to smell it again. Oh my god, I love it. It smells so 
Amazing. I have one, two, three, four, five, I have eight of them. Which is here's four of the blueberry crumble. Here's another two. Oh. And then this is the last four and my final collection of soaps. That is all I have. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I love y'all. See you soon. Bye.